Good morning, good morning, good morning. Happy Wednesday and welcome back to a new day of learning. Let's start with the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the Republic for which it stands. One nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Now the Royal Pledge. I will respect myself and others, offer kindness, act with integrity and remember to persevere. Happy Wednesday everybody. Hope everybody had a great Monday and a great Tuesday and has managed to sign into Canvas with no more technical issues. Hooray! Things are going much easier now we all know what we're doing so that's awesome. If you have a conference with your teacher, join in on the conference, see what's going on. If you have assignments to submit, start working through them. Remember folks, we're not sitting at our computer all day long. We need to give ourselves brain breaks and we need to do some fun stuff as well. So make sure you're going to PE, to music, to art and that you're getting work done and submitted. This week, we are talking about reading. Why? Because reading is awesome and fun. Um, does anybody know where I am by the way? I just saw the cool pattern. Um, yes, I'm. <laughs> I'm actually underneath the jungle gym area in the playground because the sun wasn't in my eyes. But it's a really cool pattern on my face. Look at the sun come through. Ooh. Anyway, we are talking about reading this week. Why? Because reading is cool. I think the best thing about reading is you can read anywhere. You can read in bed. You can read on the stairs. You can read outside. You can read inside. You could read with a flashlight. could read with the lights on. You can read in daylight. When it's dark out, you need some light by the side of you to read. You can read anywhere that you are. That's the cool thing about reading. And then, when you're reading, you can take off into a magical, mysterious place or wherever you're going by reading. When you read, we imagine that we're there. We picture it in our mind and we see the places and the characters. So, reading is like going on an adventure without ever leaving. It's the safest adventure you can do. How fun is that? So, yesterday I asked some of our teachers some recommendations. I'm gonna tell you what Mrs. Queen recommends. And as she's the media specialist, she knows a little something about books and readings. Um, Miss Queen says her favorite kind of books are Greek myths, fantasy, and historical fiction. And she said if she can find books that fit into all of those categories, she's a happy reader. Mrs. Queen recommends The Graveyard Book, Odd and the Frost Giants, Jeremy Thatcher, Dragon Hatcher, and Land of Unicorns. She says that the Percy Jackson series meet all of the criteria for her favorite genres or um, topics that she likes to read about. So, what are you going to pick up and read? Yesterday, I had to read about a bread maker. I bought a second-hand bread maker, wanted to make bread, so I had to read the instructions on how to make the bread. But then I had to download the manual off the internet and read how to use the bread maker. So two things happened yesterday. I did some reading, but I also learned something. That's the cool thing about reading. You can go on all kinds of adventures, but you're gonna learn something new. So make sure you take the time to read doesn't matter what you read pick something exciting something simple something hard just something that you're going to read and enjoy and then when you're reading it imagine that you're there in that adventure so in my bread maker I had to imagine I was using the bread maker which is easy because I was but I really had to understand what I was reading and think about the instructions so when you're reading understand what you're reading and imagine that you're there it takes you away to a wonderful place also Get your parents to show you our Facebook page because I'm going to be posting some pictures of some of our teachers reading. Check back each day to see what other teachers enjoy reading and make sure you pick up something to read today. If you are having troubles with technology, pick up a book and read. Once you're done reading, go for a walk, do some jumping jacks. So read and be active if you have any technical issues. Hopefully they're all over and everything is great. Remember, today is a great day to learn. What are you going to learn today? Maybe today you're gonna to learn how to use something new in Canvas. I don't know. Today is a great day to be kind. Remember, always be kind to everyone around you. Use kind words, be helpful, be thoughtful, just be kind. Today is a great day to be the best you you can be. Remember, always do the right thing. Be respectful, be kind. Integrity tells us we're always gonna do what is right. And if we make a mistake, we take responsibility and we fix it. I hope everybody has a great Wednesday. And remember, be kind, be kind, be kind some more. I'll see you all tomorrow. Have a great day.